Hi, my name is Lonnie Hay. I'm the founder, president, and CEO of LMT, and I'm a proud Navy veteran. Military service is a tradition in my family, and when I was little, every summer my father would take the kids to watch air shows down in Patuxent River, Maryland. And I remember watching the Blue Angels fly and dreamt of someday becoming a Blue Angels pilot. I went into the Navy when I was 17 via the Naval Academy, and then I served on active duty for five years as a Naval Intelligence Officer and in the Individual Ready Reserves for three more years. Being a part of a winning team is what I'm most proud of. During my two years with my operational unit, we won the Battle E, which is awarded to the unit with the highest state of battle readiness. My squadron was made up of some of the most professional, focused, and dedicated personnel that worked together as a team. And we adopted a work hard, play hard mentality, but always in that order. Some of the best mentors that I had on a day-to-day -day basis were the senior enlisted Navy Chiefs and Marine Corps Gunnery Sergeants that I came across early in my career. The Navy was absolutely instrumental in instilling a sense of confidence in me. Um, they place so much responsibility on individuals at such a young age, and um, without a safe, with, with that safety net of knowing that you're surrounded by people that will help you so that you won't fail. And that confidence has basically instilled a sense of confidence in me to continue to achieve in the civilian sector. My military service gave me an understanding of how the Department of Defense is structured and gave me the technical skills to build a business where I could continue supporting our national security interest in the civilian sector. The business that I started is so deeply connected to supporting the Department of Defense, it still makes me feel like I'm a part of the team without um, being in the military on a day-to-day -day basis. I mentor young women who are considering the military as a future career, women who are thinking of attending one of the service academies, or want to join via the Officer Candidate School. What I would tell potential sailors is that there's nothing more rewarding than serving your country alongside the brightest people this country has to offer. We have the number one military in the world, and it was a privilege to have the opportunity to be a part of that team.